circumstances of lockdown. We're maintaining our social distance here, uh, and we're very much looking forward to you coming up to Hagley in September. Um, I'd like to introduce you now to a key member of staff who's going to be working with you from September as your head of Year 7. Hello, my name's Mrs O'Loughlin, and I've been at Hagley for about 16 years, Okay, and I've been working on the pastoral team for many years. I am so excited to speak to you this morning and hopefully to settle some of your worries for the coming months. Okay, so as we would normally do at Hagley, at any time we would say our school prayer together. In the name of the Father, Father and the Son, and, and of the Holy, Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. Amen. St. Nicholas Owen, make, make this school a safe refuge, refuge inspiring in us a love of God and a love of our neighbour. neighbour. Guide, guide us in our work and play, that, that we may always be faithful, faithful to Christ, Christ our Lord. Lord. Amen. In the name of the Father, Father the and Son, of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Spirit. Amen. So over the next few weeks we are going to set a few challenges. So my challenge to you, Year 6, is can you learn that school prayer off by heart? It's something that you all need to know for September. And I know Miss has also got a challenge for you to work on. Okay, my challenge is something that you'll learn about me in the coming months is I am a keen gardener and at this time in isolation we're promoting health and well-being and i would love it if as many of you got involved as possible okay so stay safe protect the nhs and garden so my challenge to you is i'm going to be writing to you in the next couple of weeks and i'm going to be sending you some sunflowers i want you to plant them i want you to document um, some photographs with you and so that you too can be involved in our project here at hagley during this isolation. All right, stay safe and garden. Unfortunately, obviously we can't come to visit you uh, this summer term in your schools because they're closed at the moment, but at least you've got to see us virtually this term. Um, as Miss said, do look after yourselves. We are very much looking forward to welcoming you up to Hagley very soon uh, and you're very much in our thoughts and prayers. And one thing I did share with you in my primary visits last term was that the phrase, do not be afraid, appears 365 times in the Bible. So that's once for each day of the year. So let's remind ourselves that God is with us every single day and not to be afraid. Everything will be fine. Take care and God bless. What advice would you give to Year 6 travelling by train to school? So uh, Year 6 is travelling on the trains. Well, then we'll be Year 7s. It's nothing to worry about. Um, trains are completely safe and um, really all like... There's the CCTV, so it's really safe on the trains. And th if like it's ever delayed, there's always going to be another one, and the school always gets notified, so you shouldn't worry if it gets delayed. And if you're late for the trains, or there is always going to be another one. And also, the timetables for the trains are really straightforward, and they're really easy to read. And what's your top tip for those starting in September? Um, my top tip is to just be yourself, because if you, you fake being what you are, then it's not really going to get you anywhere you should always just be yourself because like you you're always going to make friends and you're always going to have those times where you need to show like show that people that you are like who you are and you shouldn't like pretend to be someone that you're not so what advice would you give to year six about completing their homework in september well at hagley we have an app called class charts using this we can keep track of our homework and when it's due and it's important that if you're not sure of what to do, go to a teacher during your lunch or break or email them. And what's your top tip for those starting in September? Um, do your homework the night you get it. So is it easy to make friends, would you say, for Year 7 when they come up in September? Yeah, you can go to extracurricular clubs and there'll be lots of new people there and they'll also have the same interests and hobbies as you, so it'll be really easy to make and in your form group, you can find loads of people in there as well. And what's your top tip for those starting in September? Uh, to be organised and pack your bag the night before for the lessons that you have the next day.